you think? Oh, I'm very excited. Um, for the past three years, it's been all the same teams that we've been playing. So I guess I'm really excited to see the new teams that we play. It's an honor. For the past four years, I've been playing as hard as I can and finally paid off. Hoping to make it as far as we can. I have no rings yet, so I'm really hoping this is the year. <laughs> Uh, I've been the team get to a, a winning season. It's a new conference, new competition. I'm looking forward to seeing what Texas teams are about and just pitching a new competition. I never really worry about if they have a scouting report, then they should know what to expect. They should be able to hit it. It just challenges me more. Um, I think since the second year, I, it has to be better than it was the first. Um, I think I, you can always improve, and I think I need to work on some things and hopefully get better and help the team win. Um, it's great helping the other girls. It, it's great to help them mentally uh, in the game and also physically and help them achieve their goals. Um, I just want everybody to be as, as good as they can be. Well, it's exciting with our transition to Division Three from NAI. Uh, things really haven't changed a whole lot for us as a program or a team. We're still able to recruit the same type of players get the same type of talent in here. So from a competitive standpoint, we're moving out of a really good league and into arguably the best Division III softball league in the country. So it's kind of what we're used to in the NAIA, and we're just going to be doing it in a different association. Now NCAAs came off a really good year last year as well. She was injured a lot last year. I think she's healthy now. and. Anytime we give her the ball, she's capable of being one of the best pitchers in the country in NCAA Division III. Uh, just a power arm. She's played on a national championship team in junior college and won over 40 games for LSU Eunice in doing so. So she's got the confidence and she's got the experience to help lead our staff again this year. Haley Assis, uh, being a returning senior, uh, means a lot to me and it means a lot to our program. She's a kid that has been in our program since she was a freshman. Um, she kind of holds a special place in my heart because she was one of the first players that I recruited that has gone through the program all four years. Ashley Hitt was the, the other one who graduated last year, but the experience Haley will bring, she understands the competitiveness of this level of play. She understands how I expect our team to play and she's a leader and she can lead us in that regard just from that experience that she has. Our field renovation has been phenomenal both for recruiting and for the morale of our players. Our players are really excited. Everything inside of our gates uh, were gutted out and got brand new uh, sod, brand new grass, outfield playing surface, new drainage and irrigation. The infield surface is brand new and it's just Pride, pride in the program. And I give a lot of thanks to uh, our athletics director, Scott Little, and President Dr. Parrott for um, allowing us to spend the money to do the things that we needed to do to make this facility on par with the majority of other facilities in our conference.